Hey folks, John Ferguson Smart here. I want to talk about the interview techniques that people often teach to help testers get into test automation roles. A lot of posts I see talk about practice questions and techniques to get through a technical interview uh, during a recruitment process. Now, I find learning these techniques or teaching them in particular actually to be wrong. It's immoral, it's lying. It's trying to cheat your way into a position and that never pays off because once you get into that position, guess what? You don't actually know the techniques that you claim to know. You find yourself struggling, you'll find yourself floundering and you'll get stuck or worse, you'll lose the job that you, that you got your way into. So in all of the coaching programs that I run, I do not teach interview techniques. I do not teach how to answer questions like that. However, after what I see is the people on the program get into senior test automation roles, get into test automation roles very quickly. They pass the interviews with flying colors. I think the record so far is in under a month, one of the students got into a senior test automation role from, from scratch. I mean, she put in the work, she did a lot of effort, but uh, she passed those interviews with flying colors without being taught specific interview techniques. Now, how does that work? Well, it's very simple. If you understand the techniques, you understand the practices, you understand the principles behind those practices, you don't need to learn how to answer questions. You can just be honest. You can just be yourself. And it becomes very natural to be able to talk about what you know and what you've done and what you've seen. And that's the power of learning techniques in depth, learning not only the surface techniques, not only the how, but the why and what you need to do in different situations and why you need to do things in different situations. That's what you need to learn. And that comes from practice, that comes from mentoring, that comes from time, that comes from putting in the effort to do that learning. It doesn't come from superficially learning how to answer interview questions. So that's what I wanted to talk about today. Thanks for listening, folks.